we want to basically be able to change some of the parameters on this uh, grass so that it sits a little bit better in the scene. So if I um, right click on this and if I create material instance, I'm basically going to create this grass instance which I will drag onto my object for now. I'll open it up. Basically, what you've got are three parameter groups, uh, which are the groups I set up, and I've got grass color. So if we start with the base color, a bit closer. And we can change this. So I could go in and try and color pick something. It's closer, or I could just go in and start to that's not too bad. And then I've got my base tint, which is the brighter bit at the top. I could try and find it in here. Not sure I'm going to do. I'll just put something like that. Then I've got my base variant. Which I can use the tint. I want like some more yellowy ones, like something like that. That blueness is coming from the roughness. Set up. Now there's a base contrast as well, so I could you know, put this down a bit to kind of make it all blend a bit. Or, or I'll go back to two. Um, under roughness, I've got my high clamp and my low clamp. I keep my high clamp as it is, but I'm going to pull my low clamp up a bit to maybe try and get rid of some of the blue. So I'm going to point three. Yeah, see that's got rid of it. So yeah. that's okay. And then we've got wind. So we can change the intensity. So I can make it like those more intense or not very intense at all. I can change the speed. Get to do an advance. Or slow. So the way we set this thread up now means we've got plenty of options for how we set our grass up, yeah, which is great. So what I'm going to do is now look at how we set up the grass to work with the foliage tool.